Hi, my name is Susan from Bid Recruit. Bid Recruit is automated and AI driven recruitment software. Our software allows you to streamline your recruitment process, reduce down your recruitment costs and reduce your recruitment admin significantly, helping you focus on finding the right candidates and attracting the top talent for your business. But we know at Bid Recruit that attracting the top talent and finding the right candidates is really only the first step in the employee life cycle. With that in mind, we partnered up with Fiona Donnelly of Nexus Consulting. Fiona, why don't you start us off by telling us a little bit more about yourself and where you really specialise. My work is in the area of employee experience, company culture and employer brand. So in effect, I do look at issues in companies that really go across the whole talent spectrum from that pre-hire stage to retire. And that brings in the whole areas of talent attraction, talent development and talent retention. Why don't we start off by discussing something that's incredibly topical at the moment, and that's culture fit and recruitment bias. Well, obviously all companies have a drive towards recruiting top talent. And in actual fact, it really should be that companies focus on recruiting the right talent. But as we are all human, we all have unconscious bias. And that's where we would call that maybe a hiring bias, for example, or a recruitment bias. And what that means really is that we, we, because of our biases as humans, we're conditioned to think in certain ways. So because we might identify with candidates, we might be more drawn to them. It's important in terms of employment equality, corporate ethics, uh, inclusion and diversity that we see beyond biases and we try to make the whole hiring process as impartial and objective as possible. So can you advise the best practices that you yes. um, say to companies to, to help them overcome this challenge? Okay. Sure, and there are three really that would stand out. The first one would be to give hiring managers or anybody in a position of recruiting or hiring to make sure that they understand that we all have biases. So it's creating an awareness and I would highly suggest that they would undertake some sort of bias awareness training. The second thing that I would say is to literally look at your job descriptions. It's very important to sometimes to go back and look at that design and see if there is any way that there was an inherent bias placed literally within the content. And the third thing then, Susan, would be to standardize interviews. So again, what that really means is that everybody will receive the same standard of interviews. So that's kind of more of a structured interview. Thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us today, Fiona, and thank you so much for watching. We'll be back next time where we'll discuss more on the talent management landscape and the topical trends in the recruitment industry today.